Hello and welcome to the Corpus Linguistics Workshop by Dr. Barami Khewishai. Today I'm going to introduce some basic functions of collocates in NCOM version 4.2.0. So let's get started. First, let's load your corpus text into NCOM. Today we will use the American English 2006 corpus. Now we can use the collocate function by uh, clicking on the collocate tab on the top like this. We can type a search word in the box right here and click start. So here are the results and these show the collocate types and token and also how many times the collocates occur on the left or on the right of the search term. The fifth column shows the statistical value of the likelihood and the last column shows the effect size value. The likelihood value measure how certain you can be that these are collocates what the effect size show you how strong their associations are. If you click on the collocates, like double click on it, it will bring you the concordance lines. We can make some adjustments to the collocates function. You can just the window span right here, that is setting how far from the search term should the software looks for the collocates. So L means left, R means to the right. You can set the minimum frequency right here. Mm -hmm. And the minimum range, that is the number of text these words have to occur in, right here as well. And you can sort the collocates based on uh, the overall frequencies, frequencies on the left, frequency on the right, uh, word endings, uh, statistical value, and so on. You can even have an invert order that is starting from the lowest to the highest. In addition, we can adjust the setting of the collocates by going to setting and two settings and then you can select collocate here you can see the default settings for displays uh, statistics so the default statistics for likelihood measure is log likelihood and uh, the default statistics for the effect size is mutual information. You can also set the threshold if you want to focus on, let's say it's the top 10, top 50, top 100, or you can set the threshold of likelihood measure if you want it to be uh, more strict, okay? Um, and after you set everything make sure to click on the apply button first right here okay. and you can download these color kits for further analysis by clicking on files and then select save current tab results and you can save the output in a plain text file I'm not going to uh, save it here. So, yeah, these are the basic color kit function in Ancom version 4.2.0. And that's it for this video. Thank you very much for watching and stay tuned for the next video. Until then, goodbye.